Welcome back. It's time for coins. Today, I wanted to take a look at uh, coins with chips on them. And I have a variety of uh, coins from different countries and from the United States also. So the first coin I wanted to look at is this uh, 1964 half penny it's from the UK. It has Queen Elizabeth right there. And on this side right here, it's just a half penny and it has a really cool little uh, ship right there. And I kind of feel like it looks a lot like the uh, ship from uh, Peter Pan. So they have a Peter Pan ship right there. And I think that's uh, looks pretty, uh, pretty close to, uh, to that ship. So I thought that was kind of cool. And then I also have this coin right here. It is from the East Caribbean uh, states, 1999, it's 25 cents. And that's a pretty nice looking coin too. It looks very similar to the, the other coin that I had. And also has the Queen Elizabeth on there. Now, I was looking in my book and I found uh, a coin here. It was from Rhode Island uh, Ship Metals. And I thought this uh, this coin was pretty interesting. It has a ship right there. And then there's uh, like, so a land, looks like a land mass with a small little ships over here, a little boats over here, and then three giant ships here. I thought that was pretty interesting. This is from uh, 1778 to 1779. And I'll go ahead and read this thing right here. It says, The obverse shows the flagship of British Admiral Lord Richard Howe at anchor, while the reverse depicts the retreat of American forces from Rhode Island in 1778. The description shows that the coin was meant for a Dutch-speaking audience. It is believed the metal was struck in England circa 1779 or 1780 for the Dutch market as propaganda to influence Dutch opinion against the American cause. Specimens are known in brass, copper, and pewter. Yeah, so that was a uh, interesting kind of pre-federal coins right there. And then we also have this one here. I showed the case this one a little over a year ago. This is the Rising Sun of the, the, from the Black Flag series, the William Moody. It's one ounce fine silver. And I thought this one was just a, a really beautiful coin. It's, the, it's like a pirate ship right here. It's some, looks like some tears in the sails. And there's, you see in the distance right here, there's a ship, uh, looks like it's being, uh, on fire and, and sinking and you can see the the, cla the smoke coming up with a little skull right there it's just an absolutely beautiful beautiful coin and so yeah the sh coins with ships on them are just uh, awesome and this one was from uh tubaloo i believe yeah tubaloo in 2022 this was last year and they made uh they were putting out one coin a year but I haven't seen anything come out yet for the Black Flag series this uh, this year, so I'm not sure if maybe they were just doing a, a, like a four year, four or five year run, and that's it. But yeah, it'd be kind of nice to be able to get some more of the of this series. Uh, this next one is a, a Noah's Ark coin, and it has the dove right there. The God flooded the world, and there's the the Ark right there with the the sun in the background and I'm not sure if that's supposed to be clouds or or land oh it's kind of interesting it's kind of like mountains in a way yeah really lovely coin it's uh it is a coin and it is from the Republic of Armenia so I thought that was really interesting to be actually have a, a government actually still put Christian uh 
symbols on, on their coins. So this next one is the uh, Mayflower coin. It came out in uh, 2020 from the Royal Mint. And I did a video on this one uh, oh, around January or so, or December of last year. And uh, it's a lovely coin. I really enjoy this and I love the what it represents with the Mayflower and Protestants fleeing religious persecution and coming to America. Yeah, so it's pretty, pretty awesome. So if you want to uh, go into detail on seeing all the information inside this little packet, uh, you should go check out the Mayflower uh, video I had. The next coin I have here, this is the James 400th anniversary commemorative coin. And I bought this one back in I think it was 2007. I think it was 2007. So this is one of the first uh, coins I got in my collection. And I just absolutely liked this one. So on this side you have the settlers of Jamestown. You have an Indian right here and uh, some pilgrims. So I thought that was really lovely. And it says the founding uh, Jamestown. 1607 to 2007 and it's just nice it's a nice frosty fish there it looks like you can see the the ship in the background right there at least i think that's a ship right there and then on the back you have three ships so this is this is a um i think it's four nines fine silver it looks like it was minted in uh, philadelphia yeah, absolutely gorgeous coin. So before I get into that one, I have one more ship right here. And this was on the state quarters. Now these are actually silver, the silver quarters that I were able to pick up. And you can see it has the, uh, the San Francisco mint on them. And uh, yeah, so this one is the Rhode Island. Yeah, uh, the state came, started in 1790. And there's a nice cool little, little sailboat there with a bridge behind it. So that's a, that's a pretty awesome looking, looking coin. I'm kind of curious if that's the same, supposed to be the same sailboat as this next coin. So if you don't know, this was the uh, current presidential Sorry, not presidential. Uh, this is the current $1 coin series, the Innovation series. And they also have a, the silver right there. Yeah, so it is, uh, looks like it might be the same one possibly. Yeah, this is Rhode Island. And this one was, yeah, Rhode Island. So check that out. Makes you kind of wonder why they uh, put almost the same coin on for each, each for the same state. I guess the ship looks the ship looks a little a little bit different, but you only you're missing the top part of it, so could totally be the same ship. It's interesting. So yeah, so those are the coins with ships on them that I have. I think it's really awesome to have these different uh, uh, designs on these uh, coins. So yeah. Let me know if you like ships and coins or trains or what, what you like to collect. And I will uh, go ahead and see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.